It's the magic of math here, and today we're talking percent of increase as we can solve a real world problem. Here's our math question today. We have Sharon who has a patio in the shape of a rectangle. The length of the patio is L feet, and the width of the patio is W feet. Sharon plans to expand the patio by increasing the length by 50% and increasing the width by 20%. Which of the following expressions could be used to find the area in square feet of the expanded patio? And you're given four answer choices. So, your turn right now. I'd like you to pause the video here, solve, and then come back to see a solution. Welcome back. So, here we have that we have a patio in the shape of a rectangle. So, let's draw a picture so that we can visualize what we're dealing with. We're told that the length of the patio is represented by L feet. So here's our length and L. The width of the patio is W feet, so we're gonna label that W. So now Sharon is gonna expand the patio by increasing the length by 50%. So the length is gonna increase by 50%. And then she's gonna increase the width by 20%. And then we have to write an algebraic expression and then find which one it's equivalent to. So here we need to understand that to find area of a rectangle, we're gonna do length times width. So now we need to replace L and understand how L is changing when we increase it by 50%. So we know that we're gonna have L, so we're gonna bring down our L and we're gonna increase it by adding 50% to it. So to find 50% of L, 50% of L is 0.50, multiplied by L. We have to add that on to the existing L. So there's an invisible one here. So we have 100% of the length and we're gonna add 50% of that length. Then we're gonna multiply by the width. So now we have our width where we're gonna start with our original width and we're gonna add 20% of that width to the original. So understanding that we have this invisible one in front of the L, and then we have like terms, and we have the invisible one in front of the W, and now these are like terms. So we have 1L plus 0.50L, which represents 1.50L, and that is, if we write this as this decimal as a percent, that's 150%, which makes sense. We're gonna have 100% of what we started with plus an additional 50%. So our width is gonna be 1w plus 0.20w or 1.20w. So 120% of the width. Now let's go look and see what we have over here and we could see that that is answer choice A. So thank you for joining me today at The Magic of Math to talk about percent of increase and understanding how to write an algebraic expression. So that's The Magic of Math where we continue to master math one video at a time. I hope you'll come back soon and have a great day.